Good evening and welcome to Compline on this Monday evening. Let's take a moment as we gather our thoughts as we come to our service of Compline tonight. O Christ, Son of the living God, may your holy angels guard our sleep. May they watch over us as we rest and hover around our beds. Let them reveal to us in our dreams visions of your glorious truth, O High Prince of the Universe, O High Priest of the Mysteries. May no dreams disturb our rest and no nightmares darken our dreams. May no fears or worries delay our willing, prompt repose. May the virtue of our daily work hallow our nightly prayers. May our sleep be deep and soft, so our work be fresh and hard. I will lie down and sleep in peace. For you alone, Lord, make me dwell in safety. My dear ones, O oh God, bless thou and keep in every place where they are. Into your hands I commit my spirit. I give it to you with all the love of my heart. How precious to me are your thoughts, O oh God. How vast is the sum of them. Were I to count them, they would outnumber the grains of sand. When I awake, I am still with you. I make the cross of Christ upon my breast over the tablet of my hard heart. And I beseech the living God of the universe. May the light of light come to my dark heart from thy place. May the spirit's wisdom come to my heart's tablet from my savior. That's Teddy on the top shelf, just behind you. <coughs> Excuse me. Exodus 14 verse 14 says, The Lord will fight for you. You need only to be still. When Moses led the Israelites out of Egypt, they fled on foot as Pharaoh pursued them with his chariots and horses. To make matters worse, they found that their path of escape was blocked by the Red Sea. Yet God supernaturally opened the way for them. They didn't have to fight and they didn't risk drowning. They just had to obey what God said. Tonight, pressures around you may be building up and your way may appear obstructed. However, don't panic and don't do anything reckless. <laughs> Rather, be still. Listen to God and wait for his instructions. He will certainly make a way for you as well. Further on the chapter that we read, verses 29 and 30. The Israelites walked through the sea on dry ground with walls of water on both sides. On that day, the Lord saved the people of Israel from the Egyptians. Christ without sin, Christ of wounds. I'm placing my soul and my body under thy guarding this night. Christ of the poor, Christ of tears. Thy cross be my shielding this night. O thou son of tears, of the wounds, of the piercing. I'm going now into the sleep. Albeit in thy dear arms keep, O God of grace, that I shall awake. And let's have a short prayer as we move into the time of quiet. Dear God, thank you for making a way for me. Help me to be still before you and I will wait for your instructions.
Let's say the Lord's Prayer together, shall we? Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. My Christ, my Christ, my shield, my encircler, each day, each night, each light, each dark. My Christ, my Christ, my shield, my encircler, each day, each night, each light, each dark. Be near me, uphold me, my treasure, my triumph. Circle me, Lord, keep protection near and danger afar. Circle me, Lord, keep light near and darkness afar. Circle me, Lord, keep peace within and evil out. The peace of all peace be mine this night. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for joining me at the beginning of another week. Take care of those around you and also take care of yourself. And we continue, as always, to pray for the Ukraine. Good night and God bless you.